Now, the bit of the show where we send a pro into a cook's kitchen at home for a very special masterclass. To prove that, with a little skill and inspiration, anyone can create restaurant quality food. The chef running this week's masterclass is Theo Randall. He is a master of Italian cuisine who's won countless awards for his unfussy yet utterly delicious rustic fare. Well, I'm not quite sure what to expect today because we're in Bath, which is a beautiful place, but we're going to a student house and I'm, not, <laughs> I'm a bit worried about what that fridge might look like. Theo is off to meet Bianca, a business student at Bath University, who's bonkers about food. I enjoy cooking, I enjoy eating a lot. I would say I have quite an unhealthy obsession with food. I'd love to cook more with meat. I think it's something really difficult to perfect, so to learn that from a chef would be incredible. Bianca. Hi. Hi. Theo, hi. Theo is going to teach Bianca how to make an Italian roast of pork loin wrapped in copper di parma with a side of creamy potato, fennel and parmesan. Not exactly student fare, is it? <laughs> A few tins opened. Mm -hmm. Someone's been at the hummus late last night. <laughs> when was the last time you cleaned the fridge? Um... <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about that. We don't need the fridge. I've got everything here. So I'm going to do a pork dish. First off, the pork loin has a little trim. This is my favourite little loin. Oh, pie. lovely. <laughs> Great. Brilliant. Oh, it's blunt. Ah, uh, <laughs> so. overused. You haven't got a steel. Use the back of the knife. We want to keep some of that fat on there, because the fat's where the flavour is. Cut down the bone. Mm -hmm. And we're going to release that lovely big chunk of meat. To make this pork top nosh, Theo prepares a rub to help it along. A little trick with garlic is put a bit of salt on there and then use the salt almost like an abrasive. And you can just sort of mash that garlic into a paste. Rosemary goes really nicely with pork. Oh, okay. so, so I always think quite hard herbs go well with pork. So things like um, rosemary, sage, thyme. Zest this lemon. This knife's really sharp now. <laughs> Get a little bit of juice. Butter. Mash this all together. Spread this over on this side. And wraps it with a special Italian salami. So what exactly is copper de parma? So copper de parma is a kind of salami. Uh, this particular one has been brined in sugar and salt and lots of herbs. All the fat in there will actually go through the pork and base the pork and give it loads oh, and loads wow. of flavour. Pancetta or prosciutto work very well too. They're roasting the pork at 190 degrees centigrade until it's cooked but not dry, about 30 to 40 minutes. Next for the creamy potatoes. Theo's perking them up with fennel, a rather assertive bulb. If you take the outer bits off, it can be a little bit tough. It's, if you look at this, it's very sort of, it's quite stringy. Yeah. Fennel is crisp and very aniseedy when raw, but when it's cooked, it becomes soft and mellow. A bit like me after a spa. To bring it all together, they mix garlic, double cream, and plenty of parmesan. We haven't got a grater, so we can use a serrated knife. Watch your hands, though. Mix it all together. Yum, yum. Pop this in here. And it's baked for 30 minutes until crispy. While the pork rests, Theo whips up a jus with a splosh of sweet wine. I just want to get the lovely bits in the bottom of the pan because it's yeah. where all the flavour is. It's almost like a stock cube. And it's reduced in five minutes. Theo and Bianca have created a slap-up student meal for her housemates. Roast pork loin wrapped in crispy copper de parma with creamy baked potato, fennel and parmesan served with a fresh herby salsa verde and a sweet wine jus. Guys, I'm ready for you. Hi, I'm Hi, Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Cheers. 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 That's amazing. There's so much flavour in it. And the pork is really juicy. And I like the sauce as well. Good. Mm -hmm. Every dinner party, I'm going to impress <laughs> everyone with this dish. You will perfect this dish. I will. I thought today was brilliant. I think Bianca really enjoyed it. And she learned something. Theo is an incredible teacher. And I think I have actually found my new go-to Sunday roast. So that's fantastic.